Hi, my name is Jillian Stewart, and I'm the founder of Surf and Turf Therapy. Uh, beside me, I have some of my teammates, and we are a nonprofit where we work with children and adults with disabilities, and we take them horseback riding and surfing for physical, occupational, and speech therapy. We proposed for the 100 Horsemen grant that we would write a children's book about inclusion. While I work with these patients, a lot of them are in wheelchairs, they have limited mobility, they have a hard time connecting with their peers. They often are looked down on because they're in a chair, so people are literally looking down at them. And there was a day where we took the horses into Los Rios with a certain patient, and he was so proud and so happy that everyone was coming up to him, they wanted to interact with him, and they were just so mesmerized because of the horse. And the horse really helped bring the community together for him and make him so that it, people weren't afraid to approach him because a lot of times kids are unsure of how to interact with someone with a disability. So we would love to take some inspiration from a lot of our clients in moments like these and how the horse has helped to build a community and how it's a part of bettering so many lives and a part of San Juan and the culture here. So we would write a children's book where we loosely base characters upon some of our patients and their inspiration. And then we would take that book and we would give copies to local schools, local libraries, local coffee shops, hotel lobbies, anywhere and everywhere where people who might not know about the horse and how important it is to the culture and history of San Juan and give it to those places. And then what's great is we can continue to sell it at other you know, partnering groups, hopefully local stores, online, things like that. And then we can divide the proceeds between the Equestrian Coalition and Surf and Turf Therapy to continue supporting both organizations and both missions, which truly rely on the horse and the wonderful community that is San Juan Capistrano and keeping it all together uh, as it should be. So I really appreciate the consideration and everyone who donated to the 100 Horsemen project. It's so, so cool to see how many people can come together so quickly to make something happen, all because of these awesome furry friends and making sure we keep them in San Juan. So I appreciate the consideration and I look forward to seeing the other entries.